Hello friends, today we shall discuss time value of money. Time value of money is the concept that a sum of money is worth more now than the same sum will be at a future date. And this time value of money is the core principle of finance and in the economic evaluation of many projects including highway projects. A sum of money in hand has greater value than the same sum to be paid in the future. That is the basic principle. And investors prefer to receive money today rather than receiving the same amount in the future. And if the money is invested on a highway project is to get return in the next 20 years for example, then how do we compare the value of money invested today and received later? That is the importance of time value of money. For example, you deposit some amount in the saving bank and over the time it will earn the interest. That interest is added to the principal and now this new principal will get the interest in the next year. So, you are getting interest on interest. That is the power of compound interest. If you do not invest the money or you do not deposit in the saving bank or current bank, then it will lose the value. If you keep 1000 rupees, for example, in your wallet for 3 years, the value will reduce after 3 years due to inflation. It will have less purchasing power after 3 years. That is the concept of time value of money. How the value of money changes with time. And the most fundamental formula to calculate the future value of a money is this. Future value of money, present value of money, R is the interest rate, T is the number of compounding years and N is the total number of years for which this money is invested. That is the fundamental equation, core equation in calculating time value of money. So, if T is 1, that means if the interest is paid annually, then this equation becomes that F is P into 1 plus R power N. Or this can also be written as P is equal to F into 1 plus R power minus N. That is how your money will reduce with time. So, if you want to find out what is the present value of 1000 rupees 25 years into the future, that is how the money reduces its value. This is now 1000 dollar here, 1000 rupees here and let us say interest rate is 2 percent, then at the end of 25 years here it will be around 609 rupees. So, 1000 rupees today, if it is not invested at a discount rate of 2 percent, it will be 609. If this discount rate is 5 percent, its value will be around 295. That is the time value of money. And here in this equation, T also has remarkable effect on the future value or the, or the money which you get after n number of years. Let us take one example that the present investment is of 5000 rupees for one year. We invest or we deposit in a bank 5000 rupees for one year at an interest rate of let us say 8 percent, R is 8 percent. Now, if interest is paid annually, that means T is equal to 1, then 
this future value or of 5000 rupees after one year will be 5000 into 1 plus r power 1 that is or 5000 into 1 plus 0 0.08 that is 5400 rupees. After one year, if the interest is paid annually, if it is paid 6 monthly, then T becomes 2. Then in that case, F will be 5000 into 1 plus 0 0.08 divided by 2 T multiplied by N is 1 and T is 2. That is 5408. That is the increment you get of 8 rupees. If the bank pays 6 monthly and if it pays daily, if this interest is paid daily on daily basis then T is 365 here also and here also then this amount will be something like 5440. That is how the amount increases. Future value of annuity when you pay the amount regularly at a fixed interval that called the annuity. In that case, the future amount will be a into 1 plus r power n minus 1 upon r. That is the equation. Now, a here is annuity to be paid yearly. Now, here cash flow remains same, that is a. What is the future value of this after n number of years at a this interest rate of r? If let us say a is 5000, n is 5 years and interest rate is 8 percent, then this f will be 5000 into 1 plus 0 0.08 power 5 minus 1 upon 0 0.08 and this will be equal to 29,333. What does it mean? It means that you will be paying 5000 every year for 5 years at the end of 5 years its value will be 29,333. If you take an example, let us say annual cost of maintenance of a road is 15 lakhs per annum, rupees 15 lakhs per year. Annual cost of maintenance of a road and it is to be maintained for 10 years. So, what is the future worth of this expenditure at the end of 10 years? So, A is here now 15 lakhs and N is 10 years and let us say R is 6 percent, interest rate is 6 percent. So, what is the value of F? F is 15 into 1 plus 0 0.06 power 10 minus 1 upon 0.06. This is something like 197.7 lakh. These 15 lakhs into 10, 150 lakhs. 150 lakhs will become 197. That should be the level of return to justify the investment on this road. Now, if you want to find out what is the present worth of this cost incurred for 10 years at the rate of 15 lakhs per year. What is the present worth? Now, present worth of this investment is calculated using this equation. That present worth is NVT divided by R into 1 minus 1 upon 1 plus R power N. 
सो इफ यू पुट वैल्यू ऑफ ए 15 हियर इंटरेस्ट रेट इज 0.06 पॉइंट जीरो सिक्स इंटू वन माइनस वन अपॉन वन प्लस पॉइंट जीरो सिक्स पावर टेन दिस विल बी हंड्रेड टेन पॉइंट फोर लैख वट डज इट मीन इट मीन्स दैट इफ यू टूडे इफ यू हैव हंड्रेड टेन पॉइंट फोर लैख मनी इन योर बैंक you will be able to spend 15 lakhs per year on the road for next 10 years that is the time value of money take one more example the cost of construction of a new road is 200 crore 200 crore at the current price and it is to be met with a loan from bank at the interest rate of 10% per annum and the loan period is 20 years what would be the amount of annuity to be paid to the bank every year so here again you have to find a okay so now the same equation that p is equal to a upon r into 1 minus 1 plus r power minus n this equation now you have to find the nvt a p is 200 crore what is a at the rate of 10% percent, 1 plus 1.120 minus 20 now a here is 23.5 crore every year you have to pay to the bank 23.5 crore against a loan of 200 crore taken at the interest rate of 10% for 20 years that is the time value of money very important concept in economic evaluation of five year projects Thank you very much for watching this video if you have any doubt any question you can write in the comment box